Welcome to Grand Prairie Update. I'm Don Johnson. And I'm Terry Briggs. Here's what's happening in your city. It's that time again at Grand Prairie's main library. <laughs> time to celebrate what has been another very successful year for the Summer Reading Club at an event they call the SRC Blast Off to School Burger Bash. Thank you have a good day. This year's celebration included usual favorites like balloon artists and face painting, along with some unique hands-on experiences courtesy of the Perot Tech Truck and the Dallas Zoo's STEM and U program. So the whale is much larger than the dolphin. The theme of this year's summer reading club is a universe of stories, and the people at the library also use the event to remind kids, teens, and adults to keep on reading. So our summer reading club is still going on until August 31st. You can turn in logs to any library and keep on getting prizes. Free ice cream, treasure chest, and lots and lots of books until August 31st. And the reason that this year's event was also called a Burger Bash is because of the free lunches from the people at In-N-Out Burger. There you go, man. Thank you. Have a good day. All of it a fun way to keep everyone excited and engaged as a new school year approaches. We wanted to be sure that we were including STEAM activities, so we had an art activity in here, we had technology, we had math, so we don't want you to have the summer slump, we want you active, we want you reading, so this is in conjunction with our summer reading club, and we wanted to include those math and science activities as well. For more information about the Summer Reading Club or any other library program, visit gptx.org slash library. Your property taxes a year can be anywhere from $4,500 to $13,000. Homeownership 101 classes are in session again at Grand Prairie's Ruthie Jackson Center. For the seventh year in a row, the city's Housing and Neighborhood Services Department played host to its popular Home Ownership Fair, where hundreds of potential and current homeowners can get all kinds of free information and leads from local experts on just about anything related to buying or owning a home. There are information booths and seminars hosted by bankers, credit counselors, realtors, and of course, GPHNS staff to get the word out about all of the different programs they have available. The home buying process for many is not an easy one. When you deal with a real estate agent, then you're dealing with a mortgage company, and when you go to closing, you're looking at gobs of documents. You might be looking at 15, 20 documents that you're signing, and it's better for us to be able to help you along the way to understand what you're signing. Not only that, to get you with the right real estate agent. This allows you to come in, re-interview, some of the real estate agents that are set up here, some of the mortgage companies, and you find the perfect fit for you. And that's what's so important to us, to help people to do that. That way they can realize the American dream in the easiest way possible. Hill says that more than 500 people registered for this year's Home Ownership Fair. Oh my goodness, he's so the Grand Prairie Libraries had another huge hit on their hands when hundreds of families came to see and feel a roof for you. So she sleeps during the day and she's awake at night. A Roof for You is a traveling zoo that provides up close and interactive wildlife education, complete with exotic insects and animals, including a honey bear found in Central and South America, also known as Kinkachu. K-I-N-K-J-O-U. And the star attraction on this day. Seven-month-old Jack the Kangaroo. Y'all come to see me, right? Y'all didn't come to see a kangaroo. Based out of Prosper and founded by educator Bobby Curry and his wife Stacy, the program has become extremely popular with people yes, of every age who get to learn about what the Currys describe as our planet's complex and wonderful ecosystem. He's so fluffy. He's a baby. All three Grand Prairie Library locations hosted a Roo for You. It goes well above and beyond just the educational part. There's a lot more in sync with wildlife that our hearts have for them. And at the end of the day, for me, my biggest gratitude is the smile. You know, seeing people's faces light up. It's just really, it's awesome. It's a fun thing to do. If you'd like to know more about A Roo For You, visit aroo4u.com. And for more information about all the programs at your Grand Prairie Libraries, log on to gptx.org slash library. That's it for this edition of Grand Prairie Update. Hope you'll join us again next time.